the donut. Come on, come over here to the donut. Good boy. We're having my independence back again. All the shopping and cooking and just getting out and and um just doing my own thing what I want to do. Independence to me is getting out and about on your own. Learning to do things on your own, learning to catch buses, trains on your own, learning to go to the shops on your own, learning to do your own shopping, learning to live on, on your own, learning to make friends on your own, learning to go to the rural fireys on my own. It's good to live independently uh, because you um, have your own house, do what you want and that. And yeah, and it's really good. You can watch TV and that whatever, whenever you want and that. I make my bed in the mornings and then uh, make my lunch. I do the the vacuum cleaning, dusting, uh, sweeping the, the patio, doing my own washing. Washing the, the plate after tea and make, make my bed. I always do my own chores here. I gotta brush him, feed him, wash him. Yeah, and I've got a cat named Lucky. At the moment, I'm looking for a job right now, uh, but. For those people like me who have a disability, um, they're always saying, you know, employers are saying, well, unless you can read and write, they can't employ you. That to me is discrimination. You know, a person deserves a fair go. You know, I mean, I'm out there trying to search for a job. And there mightn't be one um, now, but to me, being a real fire member and getting out there and doing what I do with the fire brigade, that to me is still a job. I go to uh, to Tay and I go to reading and writing. Next semester I'm doing uh, flash sheets. Hey, bingo, I talk to Peter Tum Tom. I went to um, see the seals, I went to see the of pay coal. We go shopping uh, to the shops once a week. Do our grocery shopping. We go to the club and have lunch sometimes. Flutter on the pokies and a flutter on Kino. Okay, I'm watching people with fix up pages and minis. Sad days I go to bowling's and have dinner and play the pokies and that. And having my own choices and not being in a institutionalised routine seven days a week. I mean, I know we're, I'm still in a routine, but I'm not in a structured routine like I was at Care or, say, at Bonnie's or I can sort of ple please myself. It's doing my own things. I've got a boyfriend, um, yeah, he lives in the valley at the moment. I had a housewarming a couple of weeks ago, that was good. I just finished buying my own bike. It makes me feel good, it makes me feel a hell, heck of a lot better. I think I've gotten stronger having, being out on my, like, in my own home and that. I can choose whatever, you know. The meal times I can choose what time I want. We want tea or whatever. You don't have to share and it's good to live independently to do what I want to do. My advice would be for them, don't let people put you down. But when they do live in independently, they know in the end that they've achieved so much. Yeah.